Okay, okay. I'm here to give you guys the details. You get me? So you want to be tall, yeah? All right. All right. My shot. You ruined my shot, bro. You ruined my shot, bro. Show and walk, man. <laughs> Keep walking. <laughs> Hi guys, what's up? Um, so you know, I was just, I was just thinking. You know, I was just sitting down. You know, I was just relaxing, chillaxing, chilling. And I was just thinking, you know, like, a lot of people want to be tall, a lot of guys and girls actually want to be tall, but some people who do not have the privilege of being tall. <laughs> right, so, <laughs> I guess so basically some people don't understand the downsides of being tall. And I'm here to give you some of the downsides of being tall. <laughs> yeah, funny, right? Downsides. <laughs> Who knew? So yeah, number one, you know, every size, shape and form walk into cobwebs, right? But do you know the amount of times I, personally, as a six foot four, do you know what, six foot four isn't even at all, right? Like, you know. Anyways, the amount of cobwebs I have walked into is just unimaginable. As in, you know, you just end up looking silly because you're walking, you're walking, you know, chilling with the man dems and the girl dems. Like, I know, I don't really have that many friends, guys, you know. So you're just walking with people, right? And then all of a sudden, you would just walk into a pole. Like, you were just walking because, for example, there's like two poles here and only certain people of a certain height can reach it, and then the people on the other levels are down there, right? So basically, you know, spiders have made your web, spun the web, blah, 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 and then you're there and you walk through it and then it just, boom, hits your face, right? And then, <laughs> you know, all of a sudden, you just start slapping your face and trying to get something off and people are just looking at you like, boy, like, you look silly, like, <laughs> What's this? You know, and then they just looking at you. Like, what are you doing? Like, are you, you're thinking. You're thinking. Like, did you guys not walk into that same cobwebs that I just did? Like, man, you stupid. You know. <sighs> Number two, you stick out. It could be a pro and a con at the same time. You know. Um, for example, just let's say you're running from the cops, right? <laughs> oh god. You're you're trying to run from the cops or or something. I don't know. You shouldn't be committing the crimes, anyways. Stay in school. You're running from the cops and stuff, right? And then next thing you know, you run into, I don't know, a crowd of people. And just imagine you're trying to hide in a crowd of people. Unless everyone else there is like six foot four or six foot five or whatever it is, you know, the same almost similar height to you, they will probably almost like recognize you just looking, just just by <laughs> I said, just imagine everyone else there is like five foot six, you know, four foot two. And then you're just there, like, yeah, there's a crowd of people. Or oh, I've seen the movies, if you just run into a crowd of people, it's very hard for the police to find you. So you walk in, you run in, and you're just there, like, yeah, I can, I can hide. Just, <laughs> just, no. no, you can't. In my case, you know, I don't have an adventurous lifestyle like that where I'm running from the cops. It's mainly when I'm hiding from people um, and they kind of just spot me. It's kind of like an awkward um, hi, kind of like, Number three. Oh my goodness, number three. Oh, I have had some experience, guys. So number three, right? You walk onto a bus. But obviously, you have like the double-decker bus. You have like the bus without the top deck and stuff. So obviously, if it's just like the single-deck bus where you just walk in, it's easier basically to, to, to go into a single-deck bus because you just walk in and your head is fine. You can walk straight, you know, that's okay, right? But then when you get a, a double-decker bus, right, the top, the top deck is normally um, shorter in height. Um, so basically, if a six foot four guy like me walks up there, I am broken off my back, you know, broke off your back, broke off your back. But yeah, so basically every single time I go to the top top deck, and I like the top deck, you know, I, I just like the top deck, okay? You just, yeah, because the bottom deck gets a bit crowded, whatever. So yeah, so I get up to the top deck and it's like every single time I'm always walking, arching my back, like, you know, <laughs> you know, it's just, it's just, it's just all ridiculous, do you know what I mean? Um, and it can kind of hurt your back a lot, ain't gonna lie. There was one time when I went to the top deck and then um, I was, I was there, I was on the top deck and I was walking, 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 looking for a seat to sit down in. And then I didn't, because I was face down, I, I couldn't see like there was a bar um, on, I believe my right hand side. So I was walking in. Um, there was a bar on my right hand side, I was looking down, I didn't see it. So I see a chair now, um, I see a seat, and I turn around to sit down, um, and I just kind of hit the bar, and I didn't realise, like I hit the bar, but I, I didn't know that my my uh, my skin was caught, uh, just around here, just top of my eyebrow. Um, 
so that was cool and i didn't know i felt like something wet but i wasn't sure what it was like i just felt like something was kind of moving or dripping down but it wasn't you know i didn't really bother to check so i got off the bus and i just touched it and it was blood adventures of a six foot bra right so number four fashion let's get into fashion i mean obviously if you're the type of person that you i guess if you're not really that active and you can gain weight easily this isn't really a problem for you but i guess for someone like me i am a dancer if you all don't know um my instagram is somewhere here you know there somewhere i don't know right so on there i post like a, a, a video sometimes um I say sometimes, but I post videos frequently, right? Um, and even on YouTube as well, you can see some of my videos on there. And if you look at my channel, um, with number four, um, fashion, right? So the way certain clothes are made, right? Um, they tend to assume that the taller you are, the bigger you are. So basically, what that means is that if you're tall and skinny, tall and skinny, tall and skinny. Actually, no, no. Let, let me know you're skinny because I'm not skinny. I'm slim. Okay, I'm slim, right? If you're tall and slim you're screwed well not really because i you have to go and get my stuff tailored but it, that's just my expense a 200 pound suit is, is on sale for 100 pounds you're thinking yes result you know? so you pick up the suit and you try it on you, there's a lot of space in there we're like bro like you know what's what's this, what's going on man i am big you know i'm not big i've given up trying to be big because i'm just way too active for that um but yeah, so then next thing you know, you end up spending like an extra 30 to 40 pounds just trying to get the, the suit and the trousers tailored and everything. It's just it's just a hassle, man. It's a flipping hassle, mate. Oh, you're having a laugh, mate. It's just flipping ridiculous. I mean, aside from the fashion as well, it's just in terms of eating too, um, it's a case of you have to, you know, you can't gain weight as easily as um, those who are shorter than you um, can gain or smaller than you can gain because there's more room to fill. Um, that kind of thing and imagine adding that on top of i'm very active it's just you know i guess this is only for certain people who are slim like me this isn't really a tall a height issue i'm just spending because i'm very annoyed i'm angry you know i guess you can't have everything you know i'm tall and dark and yeah, i have a beard i kind of have everything you know <laughs> Not just dishing out blessings and he's like, nah, 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 nah. Let's just let's relax for a little bit. Yeah, relax for a little bit. We're giving this guy a bit too much in it. We're giving him a bit too much. If we bless him too much, his head might get bigger. Like my head isn't already big as it is. Look at it. You know, look at it. Number five. You know, the tall jokes just keep on coming and keep on coming and keep on coming. Um, it is just, whew. You get a lot of tall jokes. I've been called a lot of names. Okay, I've been called lamppost. I've been called a tree. I have, I have. I've been called a giraffe, uh, longitude, of, um, I've been called a lot of names, you know. Uh, or some, some people say, oh, right, um, how is the weather up there? How is the weather down there, boy? So if you like this video, um, you can click the like button, obviously, if you like it, you like the like button. If you don't like it, um, Mm -hmm. uh, if you also like me, you're six foot four or six foot three or six foot two. I guess we can let the six foot twos in, you know, kind of, um, whatever, you know. Um, then you, I guess you guys can kind of comment if you have like similar issues with me as well. You can kind of say, oh, if there's an issue I haven't mentioned, you guys can comment down below if you, I guess if, if you want to. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, also, if you want more videos, um, or if you interested in more videos from me you can click the subscribe button um you know and if you don't want more videos then mm -hmm. um <laughs> anyways thank you guys for watching and hopefully i'll catch you later that's a boy out